Hey everyone, welcome back to Slow Active. Today we're going to be hitting another EMOM. So if you remember back to the last few weeks, every minute on the minute, okay? And we're going to be focusing specifically on our lower body today. So we're going to be doing one kind of specific lower body kind of strengthening exercise and then something else in addition just to keep your heart rate up. So the first EMOM boom, is going to be squats followed by clean and press. Okay, so we're going to do 10 squats and then we're going to do 20 clean and press. Okay, and that's going to be every minute for 10 minutes. Then we're going to have a little break, make sure that we're getting a drink ready, raring to go. And the second one is going to be Reverse lunges, followed by star jumps, okay? So like I said, we're gonna be doing a specific kind of strengthening movement on our lower body, followed with something that's just gonna increase our heart rate, okay? And over the course of the 10 minutes, hopefully, we'll start to feel like we're working, but also just get a little bit of a, I'll get a little bit of a hit on as well. So, let's just, Prepare ourselves, so stretching up to the sky, all the way up onto our toes, arms up, oh, and then we're going to stretch down and just grip underneath your toes with your fingertips. Yeah, stretching up again, and over to one side, just opening up through our ribs, over to the other. Just working through our shoulders, forward and backwards, and just rotating. Nice, just shake your legs off. Okay, we're gonna circle in and out. So three out, three in. Okay, three out. And then three in. Well done, nice, okay. So we're just gonna bend down. Come into a nice low squat position, just grip your hands together and push out through your knees. Keep your chest up, keep your eyes forward. Just open up through our hips. Nice, just relax and let your elbows come in again. And then pushing out one more time. Just really spread. Open up through those hip joints. And nice. Perfect. So we are prepped. We are ready. We are raring to go. So first one, 10 squats. And then we're going to do 20 clean and press real quick, real sharp. Get that heart rate up. Right, we're going to set our timer. Cool, right, so we've got 10 seconds. 10 rounds, we're gonna work for 10 minutes. Easy, right? Nice. So we're just working through our squats. Just 10. Good, and then your touching toes reaching up to the sky. And we're going for 20. We're going to be working for most of this time by the looks of things. Okay, if you need to drop down and do, say, five squats and 15 clean and press maybe, then that's fine. But try and keep pushing for your 10 squats and your 20 clean and press. Go. Okay, keep going, keep going. Just keep working through, make sure our fingers are coming down in front of our toes. 
Back stays flat. Work through your glutes and your hamstrings. Should feel them working. We're good. Good, and then rest in between. Nice. We should be feeling a little bit warm. Feel like our legs are working. That's the plan. 10 seconds. And we're good to go. Good. Keep dropping down into that nice low squat position. Weight comes to the mid part of your foot. Good, then touch and reach. Good. We're looking, because we've got no weight, we're looking to work nice and quick and shift through those gears and just keep moving for pretty much the whole time. And then we get that little rest. And then we go again. So what have we done, three? Three rounds done. Easy. Almost halfway there. You ready? Good, get those 10 squats out and then just start working through. Keep going, keep going. Keep working. Nice. One more round and we're halfway through. Make sure you maximize this rest period. Shake your legs out if you need to. And focus on that movement. Everything is perfect when we go through that squat pattern. Weight goes to the middle of your foot. I stay up. Arms come out in front of you, and we're sinking down, and then we're coming up. Whew. Nice. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep working. Rest once you've done your reps. We should be breathing a little bit now. Keep going. And then get your rest in. Oh, feel like we're slowing down a little bit. We're not gonna be getting much rest after this. So, are we ready? Round six, let's go. Let's go. Just keep working. Keep that squat pattern perfect. Sink down, hips back, chest up. Eyes up, arms in front, just to balance. Nice. And then just get to working. Touch, reach, touch, reach, touch, reach. Don't ever think it. Just keep going, just keep going. Oh, nice. Three rounds to go. Three rounds to go, just keep working through it. Shake your legs out. Get yourself prepped. Get yourself ready. We good? Nice. Feet shoulder width, toes turned out. And up and reach. Good. Make sure you keep your abs nice and tight and you're driving your hips through. Keep 
Okay, keep going, keep going. We're almost there. Almost there. Last two rounds. Last two rounds. Dig deep. Dig deep. Do not fall off the squat pattern though. Do not set up, think, sink, sink. So we're just looking to get that squat perfect. This is what we're focusing on. Under pressure, under fatigue now. Just keep that squat perfect. And then straight into our clean and press. Good, we're just getting the heart rate working. Keeping it nice and high. Yeah, 20 seconds left of this round. Get those reps out. Remember, you can drop those reps down if you need to. Last round, is it? Oh, I think we might have two rounds to go. Oh. Let's go. Just keep working through it. Keep going. Keep breathing. Keep filling those lungs with oxygen. Good, last round. Last round. Suck it in. 15 seconds left. We are going. Come on. Last one. Easy, right? Easy. When you tell yourself it's easy, it is. That's what I keep telling myself anyway. Good, last one. Straight into a clean and press. Once you finish, we're done for this segment. Keep going, keep going, get those reps done. Get those reps done, then we've got to rest. And we're done. Grab yourself a drink. Shake those legs out. They're gonna be feeling a little bit heavy. Fantastic, good work. Okay, one down, one to go. 10 minutes left. So, the next segment, star jumps, 30 seconds. So when the beeper goes, we are going into our reverse lunges. So we're gonna, we're gonna go for five on each leg, okay? So we're really gonna ramp it up. 30 seconds of star jumps. When the beeper goes off, Boom, straight into your lunges, and then you get a rest afterwards, okay? Again, there's gonna be very little rest in this. So, let's reset it. We are going in 10 seconds, okay? Just power through those star jumps. Get your heart rate up, breathe it out, and then we're straight into our reverse lunges. We ready? We're gonna start working now. When we hear that beeper, straight into our reverses. It's gonna start getting warm in here. So 30 seconds. Are we ready? Go. Stepping back, drop that knee down. 
Done. Oh, so we're looking at around about probably 10 seconds rest for each one. So bang out those 30 seconds of star jumps. Just keep going, just keep going, just keep going. Are we ready? Let's go. Just keep moving. We're just trying to get the heart rate up. Trying to work nice and hard. Where are we at? That's five seconds left. Keep going, just keep moving. Keep moving. Straight into our reverse lunges. Boom. Boom. Nice. Step back down. Nice and quick. Open up through the hips. Good, and then rest. Ah. What's that, two? Is that two? Oh, it's only two. Eight to go. Hopefully, you're going to be feeling as good as I am. Let's go. So we're just trying to move. Keep moving. Keep moving. So little jumps. Get those arms out. Heart rate should be raising now. And then we're going to work through our lunges. Just five on each leg, remember. Or if you can, or if you need to, drop it down to three. Stepping back, knee down to the floor. If you need to drop it down to say three lunges on each leg, or if you want to drop down your star jumps to 20 seconds, follow the timer on the screen there and just work to your own capabilities. But if you can, try and push it. Try and push yourself. And then we're done. Tuesday afternoon, finished. Just keep working, keep going. Five seconds. Straight in, keep working. Just keep moving, keep dropping that knee down. Keep those hips opening up, keep that chest up, keep those shoulders square. Okay. Hopefully, you're feeling the same as I am right now. So, we've got to dig deep. We've got to just push it. We're halfway through after this rep. Just keep moving. Keep it going. You just want to keep your heart rate high. It means we are burning calories. Oh. And we're just going to feel great after this as well. All those endorphins, all those happy hormones, just working to make us feel great, clear our mind, get away from thinking about anything too stressful, too strenuous. We're just working on, we're just working on freeing up clearing your mind and focusing on nothing but being active. That's all we're looking for with this, just to be active. Nothing more specific other than just moving. And while it's snowing outside, or has certainly been all today, we can do that from the comfort of our own living room, our own bedroom, or wherever you are. Nice. Straight into our lunges. Just work those legs. Legs should be feeling like 
Well, if they're anything like mine, leaden or another heavy material. What do we got? Four rounds left. Four rounds left. Just go. Let's go. Just push yourself. Don't give up now. Don't give up now. Stay with me. Stay with me. And we're going. And we're going. Hopefully, if you've been doing every session that we've put out over the last two and a half weeks, this should be easy now. This is an easy session. This is just, this is just moving. Should be feeling great. Ah, nice. Step back, knee down. Good. Keep that chest up. Keep that chin up. Keep working. Good. Just working on that lower body. Nothing more. Okay. Three rounds left now. Three minutes. That's all it is. That's all it is. Just put the work in and then spend the rest of your afternoon doing whatever you want, knowing that you've banked all of that movement, everything that's necessary. We're so almost there now. So almost there. Good. About two and a half minutes left to work. And then it's it, then we're done. Then it's Game Central or bit of TV, bit of Netflix, whatever it is. Lost count, can't remember. I think I did 10. I'm sure someone can watch it back and tell me I was too short or something. Right, last two minutes. Are we ready? Come on, dig deep now. Just keep moving. Just think, we're back at school. There's five minutes left of the match. And we need to score some points. Whatever that points is, this is where it counts. It's where you've got to put the work in. It's where you've got to dig deep. Ah, yes. We're almost there. We're almost through. Last round. This is it. Put the work in. Let's go. Let's go. Let's do it. Come on. Last, what, 45, 50 seconds of work. Let's go. Good. Speed those star jumps up if you can. Start moving quick. Get that heart rate up. I want you to work for this last 40 seconds now, 30 seconds. Good. The last 10 seconds of star jumps. Ramp it up. Let's get quick. And then we're into our 10 lunges. Go. Get them out. Get them out. Drop that back knee down. Chest up, core engaged. Stay tight. Two more. And breathe. And breathe. Well done, thank you Mr. Emon man. Ah, suck in the breath. Shake your legs off. That's it, we're done. We're done for another day. Hopefully, if you've had a stressful day, that's just taking your mind off things. Taking your mind off whatever stresses and strains there are within the day as a whole. And hopefully, we're feeling like we've done a little bit of work. So we're just gonna do a, little, a few stretches just because slightly higher impact. We're gonna do some calf stretches. So 
Big step out in the front, back knee straight and lean into that stretch. We're gonna hold it for five, four, three, two, one. And we're gonna switch sides. So take your right leg out, back heel down, stretch that leg out and put your weight through to the front. We're gonna hold for five, four, three, two, one. Good. I'm gonna grip one leg, bring my heel into my bum, balance on one leg, keep my chest up, keep my abs engaged. So I'm staying up nice and straight, just stretching. Five, four, three, two, one. And switch legs, exactly the same. Focus on that balance. Ooh. As I say that, hold, three, two, one. We're gonna drop into our deep squat. Elbows into our knees, pushing out our knees. Keep your chest up, keep your chin up. Hold, nice. Five, four, three, two, one. We're gonna stretch all the way up to the sky. Up onto our tiptoes. Oh. Bring your heels down and we're gonna stretch over to one side. Over to the other side. We're gonna rotate. Shake off, final legs shake off. 